Hey, when does this episode come out, buddy? When does this episode come out? That's a very good question. Let me bring up a calendar. I can tell you with definitive certainty. So next, so the next one is on the 20th and then the 27th, the third, um, hold on. I, I can give this to you. One. Does this come out the 10th? And then one, two, three, four. This comes out February 10th. February Hey 10th. guys, um, this How's is Molly coming doing? to you from, Al from Alaska. I live in Alaska now. Whoa. So yeah. That that's so I that's do. so tragic. How did that happen? I'm so sorry. I mean, on purpose. Um, I know a lot of people have been trying to keep track of me. Um, I know like definitely like my dulcimer teachers like a yarn wall with maps and pins in them trying to keep track of where the fuck I live. Yeah, ever where since in we the world is Carmen lessons. San Diego? <laughs> yeah. Um. So I'm in Alaska until the end of this year now, and then hopefully, uh, the world is. Uh, mostly healthy again, and I will hopefully go be going back to Ireland. Um, Molly Ann. I couldn't go back to. Did we do bomb? Couldn't chew go bowling? back to Ireland. Go, couldn't go back to Ireland for my safety and the safety of the Irish people. I'm not trying to bring you all diseases. Um, I came home to finish processing my permanent pre-clearance visa, and then got stuck here. Um, so you're welcome, Ireland. I've been living in in I've been living in fucking Ohio to keep you guys safe. That's how much I care about Ireland. So remember that. They'll um, sing songs about you. <laughs> the, the woman who stayed in Ohio. I think it is a lot like, so during the, um, the, the bubonic plague, AKA the great mortality in the late 1340s, early 1350s, there yeah. was a group of um, Icelandic traders who like T-R-A-D-E, ERS, like not traitors, traitors. They were who, traitors um, to the Icelandic were, yeah, treaties. No, they were the opposite because they were like, oh fuck, the plague's here. We could already have it and we wouldn't know. We can either stay here and die or risk bringing this back to Iceland. And they decided to stay there and they died. Iceland didn't end up getting the plague for another 50 years. Those so guys are the guys you want on your Among Us group. Let me tell you. Yes, exactly. And so I like to believe I'm kind of doing the same thing as they did. Dying of the plague to save Iceland, I think, is the same as living in Ohio <laughs> to protect Ireland. Are, yeah. Oh, man. That's so... I really think it's... I think it's equivalent. Yeah. I do. I mean, part I... of the time I was in Massachusetts, that was all right, I guess. Rhode Island was also all right, I guess. Um... I had some friends in Massachusetts that I really liked, so... But no one in Ohio is worth yeah. writing about. No, fuck, fuck this place. Fuck the people currently housing you. Fuck me. <laughs> fuck your mom. No. No. Um, I actually dearly love many people in Ohio. Um, but that's the thing. I love people in Ohio because love means caring about someone despite their flaws. So, um, yes. it is unconditional, and I'm willing to look past the fact that you're in Ohio. Yes. Just you're, like, you're so I mean, generous. no matter where I go, for the rest of my life, I will always be from Ohio. I can never undo that about you myself. You just need a woman who can love you people. through that. Yeah. Um, now, I am from the good part of Ohio. I am from Appalachian, Ohio. So, I mean, I'm still doing better than a lot of Ohioans, so... True. Um, there, there is, there's a lot about Ohio to love, actually. I'm being harsh. Um, there's quite a few hidden gems in Ohio. And sure. people are gonna be like, uh -huh, I know people are gonna bring up Grandpa's Cheese Barn. I've gotten so annoyed, because whenever I bring up going to Grandpa's Cheese Barn, people are like, haha, yeah, because it's a meme. No! We have been going to Grandpa's Cheese Barn annually since I was, like, six. I fucking love Grandpa's Cheese Barn. And I took all of our friends there. Now all of our friends love Grandpa's Cheese Barn. This is not a meme. In this house, we love Grandpa's Cheese Barn. It's two floors of hundreds of types of cheese. And they all have free samples. And they have, like, spicy pretzel dips. So, worst place to go during a pandemic. 
but not during a pandemic, walking through two floors of cheese samples? Shut the fuck up! Sausage samples, jerky samples, salami samples, dip samples, bread samples. What can you wear? What about Grandpa's Cheese Barn is not lovable? Where do I sign up? <laughs> Sorry. I mean, I do. I am a rewards men member. Oh, of course, of course. You gotta register now. They're one of the only places in. They're one of the only places you can get Bruno's, to, like Norwegian brown cheese, and I love that shit, so. Damn, I mean. Ooh, I'm gonna order that... some right now. Cool. Do that. I dare you. You know, I was actually talking to the subscribers, and they, they said you wouldn't. Are you gonna sit there and take Ooh, that? Here it is right now. Brunos made in Norway, this goat milk cheese is a sweet flavor and a dense fudge-like texture. Its brown color comes from the slow simmering during the cheese making process, which allows the milk sugars to caramelize. Approximately 0.5 pounds of cheese per package. All right, let's put it in order for this, baby. Nice, nice, nice. It, is it placed? cheese barn. Post an unedited no, I, picture I'm, of the I'm, shipping label with your address and card information. That's the only way we can know. No, they don't sell Bruno's online right now. No, no, no. Like if you cry every no, this time. Can't be, no, this can't be happening. No, this can't be happening. But it is. Oh, they do, they do. Okay, let me explain the Grandpa's oh, Cheese stupid. Barn website to you real Sorry, fast. Sorry, you're just stupid. So you, no, you go to grandpa'scheesebarn.com, right? Right. And then you click shop now. Then a second option opens up that says, do you want to shop? You say, yes, I want to shop. You click search store and type in the cheese you want. Nothing's found. So then you click on cheese meats and spreads. Search for the cheese you want. Nothing's found. Then you have a choice of five different types of cheese. I'm clicking imported cheese. Type of the cheese you want. Nothing's found. Then for some reason, there's yet a second page where you once again click imported cheese, and there is the Brunost. Okay. So if anybody wants to volunteer to help Grandpa's Cheese Barn with their website, um, they could really use it. That's fair. What the fuck? Shipping is eighteen ninety five. Get your own. Hey, if anybody wants to go to Kofi, that's K O hyphen S I dot com slash vampire apologist, and give me twenty five bucks so I can buy half a pound of Norwegian brown cheese. Um, this will be <laughs> on February tenth really. when you have all. You're in Alaska now, you idiot. Oh fuck. Maybe I can get it shipped straight from Norway when I'm in Alaska. Oh, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Not that Norway's yeah. any closer to Alaska than Ohio is, but, you know. Yeah, Whatever. I don't know. Damn. Damn it. I really want Brunos. <laughs> this is so fucked up. This is probably the I... most fucked up thing to happen in the past year, honestly. What's causing this? So when I this? worked for... When I worked for... Uh, state parks, I had to go to a meeting up near Ashland, Ohio, which is where Grandpa's Cheese Barn is. And I was like, oh, I'm stopping at Grandpa's Cheese Barn. And you're allowed to, like, stop for lunch in your uniform, but you can't, like, go shopping in your, like, uniform and everything and in your, like, state park's truck. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to eat my lunch at Grandpa's Cheese Barn. So I just, like, bought some sausage and cheese and jerky and dip and a whole bunch of cheese. So I went shopping at Grandpa's Cheese Barn, but technically it was my lunch. So... There you Damn go. It. I, I need, I, I need, That's... I need, I need absolute silence for just a moment. These frogs are killing me. Okay. Damn it! Damn it! Shut up! <laughs> for the record, I was singing "Homestuck Megalovania," not "Undertale Megalovania." I, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> You can't kill me, I'm in Alaska. Fuck, god damn it! Can you please? This is getting embarrassing for me. 
Molly! <laughs> God damn it. I was I was quiet that time. Now what? God. <laughs> this this hurts, buddy. This hurts. Shut. <laughs> Just stop it. Uh. You are definitely my least favorite sibling in this call right now. Hold on, I'm such an idiot. This is hard. I'm gonna cry. Okay, stop for a second, stop. You've gotten really frustrated. You need to take just a minute, just a minute to kind of just step away. It's like a math problem. You've just got to step away for a second, calm down. There's no pressure. Everyone here is rooting for you, okay? Everyone You're loves not me. Calming down. I, I think I got this. What what is going wrong? There we go. Yeah! Woo! Woo! Heart piece! I I did it! I you, did it! You got it! You were wrong! Everyone does love me! Fuck you! All right. I that's what I said. I said everyone's rooting for you. And on <laughs> that note, if you guys hey enjoyed guys, this video, it, be sure to like, like and video, comment and subscribe. Sure and if you like, like this, comment, be sure to comment and like. And, and if you, you enjoyed like, it, be sure to, be sure to like. send it to a it, like and friend sure subscribe. Goodbye. You like friend and subscribe. Goodbye. I think that might be the best outro we've ever done. Yeah, I think it went well.